that's our bus that we've just uh, been on a minute ago, the 9.05, going to Bedford. There it is. And it's 4.05 p.m. in the afternoon, not 9.05. <laughs> Remember? Um, yeah, over 400 people, uh, roughly speaking, have watched it on my YouTube channel. Really? That's, that's amazing, isn't it, Phil? Yeah. Yeah, we're just having a little bit of a break here. We will have some lunch in a minute. And uh, we're off to go to the Weeping Ash Weatherspoons in just a moment. But we're just having a little bit of a chill out. And, you know, um, it took us about 50 minutes or so. Not too long, yeah, is it? Like it is great. You're having a lovely time, aren't you, Phil? I am, mate. Yeah. He, he really is enjoying it. <laughs> It's just that we haven't been here for a long time, is it? I haven't been for ages, no. No, no, is it, is it, is it the first time with me, isn't it? Yeah. I Absolutely. Remember coming on my own, I think. You remember coming on, on your own? Yeah. But this is Cafe Nero here, and there's a market, cafe, and restaurant. There's Iceland here. This is the 905 bus where it will stop here, and it did pull off there because there's a lot of people on the bus. You might have actually seen a little bit of it. But, of course, it was empty by the time they all come off. But, yeah, there's, of course, the... I think it's called the Ferro Lounge over there. And you've got Lloyd's free cash machine, Lloyd's Bank. And uh, make the use of that before they shut down all the banks. And you've got M&Co. And, of course, you've got this St. Neat's Mini Market. All of which, or some of which... We forgot to mention last time, but we've got the lovely flowers around this area as well. Where Phil's sitting here, just relaxing for a bit on this gorgeous sort of day here in St. Leeds, just outside Cambridge. Got lanterns here. I'm sure they look gorgeous when lit up at night. This road will take you straight on to Bedford as queues of traffic coming in from Bedford. And if you turn this way, it would go on to Cambridge that way. There is a pub that we mentioned last time, and I'll mention it again. It's probably still up for sale. This cash machine we did notice last time, there was a slight charge on it. I think it's £1.25 for a charge. I think that's absolutely appalling, but there you go, that's another thing. We are due to heading to the Weatherspoons very, very soon. Yeah, and it's literally just round the corner. The church, which you can't see in view, is behind all those buildings. There is a church here. And, uh, of course, you've got the Dog's Trust here. Beautiful flowers to look at. Look at these beautiful flowers. Aren't they amazing? I've never seen that before. FBI van. <laughs> but look at the restaurant here you can see a close up this time market cafe and restaurant I'm sure they do good breakfasts in there full English breakfast and that's the price of it served all day well actually it doesn't tell you the price but of course it says it's served all day so it's nice to have something like this where you can actually sit outside on a glorious day like this, making the most of the weather. Apparently it's not going to be like this for a few days after today, but of course we are talking about the 1st of August 2023 on a Tuesday. So, yeah, we can see a... This bus is the 905, and it says Cambridge on it in the far distance if you can just read that maybe you can't but it did say that on there the yeah it, no it just said it on the actual bus at the yeah, cambridge. 905 cambridge yeah so that was heading towards cambridge okay we're going to have our lunch in just a moment here so thank you very much for watching so far hope you're enjoying the beautiful weather which is so far overcast with a bit of sunshine coming through you can see it just literally behind me. Let's talk about the weather. <laughs>
We're about to go and have some lunch now, and I think Phil's getting ready for that, aren't you? You're getting hungry, are you? Yeah. Brilliant. Let's come with us and uh, join in the fun. <laughs> and uh, see what we have got in terms of top plates, low rates, which is in this direction. Come and join us. Uh, we've done our bits and pieces. <laughs> That's the 66. 66. That one. Just about to see that there. So we've just done our bizzo. He bought some stuff from the... Yeah, that's Phil, karaoke Phil. He bought some stuff from the Iceland a minute ago. Um, a few cakes and bits. And I had um, a late down milk for a pound here. They did have the full cream version. Unlike, of course, a Great Yarmouth recently, they sold out, but I don't know if they've got any in stock. I couldn't find any turkey ham. You know that turkey ham stuff, the Bernard Matthews um, ham. They didn't have any in this Iceland, so of course you've got to shop around to find it. Maybe it's because it comes from Norfolk, as in Norwich. Let's concentrate on some nits here. Obviously there's a scaffolding here. Don't know how long that's been there for. But that's the pub we're talking about. It's still up for sale here. That hasn't changed. We've got a Santanta bank here. As we move on, and we've only got to turn a left here to go to the Weeping Ash. So yeah, avoid all this traffic so far. And we turn a left here, and the Weeping Ash is just here. This building here. Yeah, not that far, is it? Yeah, looking forward to it? Yes. Yes, we like our spoons, don't we? We like our, what we call, regals everywhere we go. Yeah, so the only difference basically is that I'm with Phil behind me who is catching me up slowly and uh, that is the difference of us coming here just us as in us two yeah, yeah. and uh, of course he hasn't even had the coke yet and he's still burping but anyway oh. never mind all that that's the second time he's done that <laughs> it's all yeah. part of the show here absolutely so if you remember rightly last time, I was showing the St. Leot's Museum, which is on the right hand side. And this is probably one of the smallest pubs in St. Neot's. The Peak and Falcon is called. Tonight at the Pig. <laughs> Tonight at the Pig. Free entry, nothing on. <laughs> Not yet. I'm sure there will be something on there. Uh, yeah, not no, no, it's not Cambridge. Oh, no, I know. <laughs> no, Cambridge is that way, mate. Oh, no, mate. <laughs> if you want Cambridge, you want that way. No, ladies oh, yeah. and gentlemen, of course, this oh, man no. gets a little bit confused sometimes, don't you? Yeah. No, we're on the path. <laughs> no, we are in St. Neots, Phil. Yeah. This is St. Neots. Uh, I, I think you only went here on your own, didn't you, once? I think so. You think so? Yeah. <laughs> It's a long time ago. You haven't been with me. This is the first time, isn't it? Yeah. L let's go in. Let's go inside. <laughs> the road leads further than this. There's a nice little uh, garden just around the corner. If it's nice, well worth sitting at. But the garden is nothing to do with the weather swings, by the way. Nothing to do with politics at all. That pub, or some sort of club there. There is two entrances, one there and one here. And you've got some flowers there, beautiful. Yeah, top plates, low rates as well. Yeah, lovely, isn't it? Thanks, Pete. There you go, top brand. Top late slow rate, still got wow. it. <laughs> and it's very quiet in here. <laughs> got the menus here, everything. Sauces. Yeah, sauces. And you've got lovely tables around the corner if you want to sit there, if you wanted to. I normally sit over there, but it's up to you. Uh, the disability toilet's just around the corner. Okay, the bike there is just here. 
Lovely floor as well. Yep. That's the disability toilet there. Plenty of tables here. I'm actually quite surprised it's quiet today, isn't it? <laughs> it's all separated tables, but you can actually join them together if you want to. But, yeah. Tea machines over there. It's up to you, mate. Where would you like to sit? You sure? You can get in there? Yeah. <laughs> We're on table number 15. Phil's talking to Julian. <laughs> He'll be watching this later. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, that's good. Yeah. You're... I've ordered my stuff on the app. You are? New manager? Oh, bloody hell. That's good. <laughs> He's in the Regal in Havel, isn't he? Yeah. He's in the Regal. That's, eh? Yeah. So these are the things it says in the latest yeah, World of Swings bad. magazine. Yeah, all right. Like a dog with a bone. <laughs> so don't hand yeah, us right out. Yeah, then. Julian, take care, mate. So Tim tops my yeah, honours bye. list. So, silly to miss Chili. SOS from the canal. And vegan desserts, where art thou? Zero interest. Wow. This is all the replies that Tim actually talks about. Summer and autumn 2023. It tells me how much I got in there. Oh, is that your yeah. phone going off there? Right next to the disability toilet. Disability toilets there, Phil, if you needed it. <laughs> yeah, not bad though. Yeah, you can use these kind of keys. £4.30. Yeah, your key will be coming soon, Phil. Yeah, you said. Yeah, definitely. For about £3 or so. Mm. Not bad, is it? Not bad. Mate. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind. I've been very, very kind and I'm going to let Phil have some of my chips. If I was having a woman sitting there, I'd do the same. Mm. <laughs> it's, it's no different. I'm, I'm going to treat Phil the same as a lady. <laughs> Phil deserves it because he sung yeah. Country Road the other day by John Denver, didn't you? Yep. You did it on our cameras, didn't you? Indeed. Yeah, it gets your confidence going, doesn't it? <laughs> so we've got that one. Yeah. And then we've got one of those. Nice, with the shandy by the way. It's got a bit of lemon in it. <laughs> he doesn't know how I do it <laughs> with all the no, cheap no. rates and all no. that kind of thing. I'm going to take my time here. I'm not going to rush it, you know. you got, of course, the sauces as usual, like we had in the Regal. Why have I got two of these? <laughs> yeah, where did you that I don't know where I got it from. But anyway, they are there, just in case I need one spare. <laughs> and then of course uh, you got your ketchup with it all ketchup I did actually put some tartar sauce not many people do that but yeah I wonder what I'm going to put on that one we'll find out in a moment I will be full up by the end of this meal here this is dinner number two here well you've got a steak and kidney pie yeah yeah Pudding. Cost you about seven pound or so, didn't it? Famous vinegar. Let's put the vinegar on, ladies and gentlemen. Woohoo! Yeah. Oh, yeah. Tell us what you were telling me, if you can remember. If not, I'll remind you. Yeah, you said you couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe, believe it, no. You couldn't believe it. I've got a bargain here. Apparently, for a day ranger train ticket, it's two pound fifty. Can't believe it. Two pound fifty. Can't believe it. Crazy man. I oh, know. Yeah, you, you love my bargains, don't you? Really. I do. I do. I do. I do. You enjoyed your meal. What was it? Steak and kidney pudding, wasn't it? Yeah. Steak and kidney pudding, chips and peas. Oh, lovely! You loved it, didn't you? I chips did. and peas, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, not beans. Yeah, that's it. Not beans, chips, uh, peas. Peas. Yeah. yeah. Great stuff. Glad you enjoyed it. I certainly did. Sums it up here. Um, I'm now refreshed after a number one. <laughs> no, I won't say any more than that. That's all right. I'm being sensible. Yeah, at the uh, 
sit there, it's weeping ash. We're weeping in sort of a way which is comfortable for both of us. Okay, which means it's overwhelmed. I don't know if that's the right word, but it is very, very happy feeling, I would say. Anyway, thankfully I haven't served my words of yet. I did beforehand, and that's quite weird. But anyway, I'm going to leave that racing thing of mine. Maybe but now. of course, um, thank you so much for watching this. And uh, of course, Phil's mm -hmm. off to his number one. We won't talk about that. I'll let him get on with that. And of course, yeah, we hope in just a moment to go round the corner and just chill out as it's sunny outside. But yeah, when we came in here, it was quite, I would say, quiet. And now listen to the noise here. I can't really show too much because it's showing people too much. You can see roughly what I'm talking about here. Like there's people coming in uh, as we start to come in. Maybe it's the time of the day like five o'clock that kind of thing but it is a very good top rates low rates and this is the comments that he pretty much said many thanks indeed for your comments not sure that everyone would agree but salavi if you know what that means in english so there you go that's one happy customer goes on to say should be of course at the house of lords <laughs> I've actually met Tim Martin, the, of course, what Phil calls the regal man. Uh, I think he did meet him, but didn't realise it was him until later on. But yeah, I do have a photograph of me with Tim Martin, the whole chairman and founder of Weatherspoons. So, yeah, he's got so many of them. So many of them are closed and mostly the pubs and restaurants have stayed open and it's been difficult since the pandemic but of course uh, what an achievement for this guy and I hope that we meet him again and uh, maybe do a quick interview if I get a chance to catch him before he goes uh, to do an interview for the uh, touring with us that'd be nice for the Regal Man to do a interview for Tori with us, wouldn't it be nice, Nick? Yeah, it'd be lovely. He's been on GB News as well. He's been on Nigel Farage's show as well, oh, which has he? been great. Yeah, that's Tim Martin, the Weatherspoons man. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, uh, we'll leave that racing for your mind. 5.51, 17.51 in 24-hour clock mode from this time here. Your time is going to be different, and it is p.m. in the evening. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next time, hopefully. And remember, we try not to bore you. Not on our clocks. We don't bore people, not on our clocks. No. <laughs> Is that right? Any final words, Phil, before we go? No. No? You, you've had enough of food for now? I've had enough, mate. I'm yeah, full up. And, and your pint and your small one as well you, you had? Yeah, I'm full up. You fill up completely. You don't want another one. Top plates, low rates. No. <laughs> I was cheeky enough to have two today. That's because of the price, isn't it, you know? Yeah. You wouldn't do it otherwise, would you? No. <laughs> Literally wouldn't, would you? But anyway. No, you wouldn't. But anyway, uh, let's hope that we both have a great journey back to Cambridge. And uh, I've got to go back to another hour after that. But, of course, I'm sure we're going to have the rest of the evening just as pleasant as it has been today. So thanks very much for coming on today, as always, like you did on Saturday, the 29th of July, 2023. And you sung Country Roads, didn't you? Yeah. You enjoyed that one, didn't you? I'll make a DVD for you, especially, OK? Yeah. Yeah, because you're going to buy some of our merchandise. Yeah. Yeah, cups, key ring, and theme tunes. choices here.
There we go, Phil. 99p for that. <laughs> not, bad, not, bad. not bad at all, is it? Okay. Yeah. We'll get you to sing Country Roads. Country Road, take me home. To the place I belong. Virginia. Mountain Rescue. Take me home. Country Road. Well done. That's it. That, that'd be enough for now. You remember that, don't you? <laughs> do that each time we do a video, yeah? Sounds yeah. good, doesn't it? Yeah. Why not? You're getting getting there each time, aren't you? Why not? You'll be on uh, top of the box soon, if that exists. Why not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we'll see you for now. Take care. Stay safe. Bye. 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 No, you can't run without that, can you? No. no.